from the peds program perspective i definitely was looking for a place that had more of like a freestanding children's hospital uh, and then just being here and everything i was really impressed by the facilities and uh, even just listening to their their pitch and everything right away it was pretty impressive just to hear about the uh, wide variety of um, different clinical diseases we would see with between the congenital heart program as well as just the fact that we um, you know, can see extreme prematurity in the NICU, and then just all the subspecialists that we do have available here. We see everything here. I think on every academic team that I've been on as a hospitalist team, there's always cases where we're trying to find case reports to try and support what we're doing because a lot of the times it's not well established um, because patients have very rare conditions, the patients that we treat here. Uh, we have a really big catchment area here at UNMC, including most of the state, um, part of uh, Iowa, um, as well as even at Children's, we have patients coming from some of the Dakotas as well. And so that provides us um, quite a few opportunities for patients that have rare diseases, as well as just high volume in cases that you need to be prepared for. Faculty is fantastic, and you know I, I think that uh, the faculty is great across all the specialties and uh, within the categorical programs. But uh, honestly, one of the things I enjoy the most about our program is our own MedPeds faculty, and it's a group that continues to grow and grow. Our, our program directors, our associate program directors, and really any of our uh, MedPeds faculty. They're honestly like family for me. I, I text them when I'm excited about something that has nothing to do with work. Uh, I go to them for advice. If, if something's going on in my life, I, they're the first people that I talk to and they're just fabulous. For us MedPeds, we have a monthly uh, meeting where they cancel our first clinic slots every month and we can discuss how we're doing. It's kind of like a uh, check in one of the attendings brings in food for all of us and, and we get to sometimes discuss uh, a nice article that's related to wellness um, and one of my favorite things also related to wellness is the beautiful yoga room we, we have here and the house officer wellness lounge where we can get to mingle or meditate and, and just see our workplace also at a, uh, like a place where we can relax and we can find peace. So for a really strong candidate for my program, I, I look at the whole application and I, I take a holistic approach. Um, I don't just look at board scores. I don't just look at letters of recommendation. I really wanna see the whole package, um, including their experiences, making sure that they have leadership and that they do experiences longitudinally or over time, not just an experience over a day here or a day there. I really want somebody that's passionate about both internal medicine and pediatrics and somebody that also has um, a really strong sense of uh, work ethic and patient care. Our, our residents are great. They're really special people. They're diverse. They have a lot of different backgrounds and a lot of different perspectives that they're bringing to the program on all people that I enjoy being with. And I think our faculty are, are very unique people. Um, they're great role models in terms of being a physician, caring for their patients, and then also how to have that work-life balance and, and make sure you're taking care of your family too.